a blend extra. Today we're talking about screw caps. Does it mean your wine is cheap or are they just trying to make it easier for you to open? We decided to call in an expert to answer those questions. Jessica Bell is the owner of My Wine School. She's also a wine educator, a wine food and travel journalist, and she has a diploma in wine and spirits. So she's going to help us with the big debate. Jessica, is it corkscrews? Or is it the screw off cap or well, the wine or the cork? Sorry. Right, no, no. Um, it, you know, neither is better or worse. I think what's going to be most important is what you think of the wine inside the bottle. Okay. And um, there's a reason why different producers will choose either cork or screw caps. Cork is a great natural material that's going to expand when wet, so it's going to create an airtight seal naturally and yet still come out of the bottle pretty easily, which is okay. a very unusual property for any kind of material. Um, but the reason that screw caps really have become very popular is that um, there can be um, some uh, taint from the cork into the wine. And it is actually that, affects the flavor of it, right? It does, and you can't reverse that. Once the wine has, has um, become affected by the cork, then you can't reverse it. And as a result, winemakers have gotten smart. They said, I don't want to lose the, this, my investment in this wine. This, mm -hmm. These wines come back to us, and we have to refund the money. So what they've decided to do, especially in new world places like Australia and New Zealand, is say, we're just going to do screw caps. Mm -hmm. And so now you see about 75 to over 90% of the wines from some new world countries having screw caps because they don't have this resistance to tradition. Okay. Right? Mm -hmm. New uh, old world wines are now starting to also say, hey, this is a really good idea to do screw caps for wines that are um, young, fruity, meant to be drunk early. So I brought you guys one from the old world, okay. Germany. This is a German Pinot Noir. It's about as old as it gets in terms of um, old world. Mm. And um, mm. I like that one. It's a fantastic. This is Becker Pinot Noir. Um, it's uh, available at my sister's butcher shop down on the third ward. Cannot tell the difference in terms of no. cork or screw cap. This was a screw cap. And also, this one's about $25. So I wanted okay. to bring a more expensive wine to show you that price does not dictate it. Um, in fact, in New Zealand and in Australia, I've got, had $50, $60, $100 bottles of wine sealed with a screw cap. So it has nothing to do with um, uh, quality or price. It's just what's important to the winemaker. And then later, they're also thinking, what do my consumers want? What do they want to see? What about storing it, screw cap versus cork? So the reason why you would store a bottle with a um, cork is because on its side, because it'll uh, make the cork wet and expand. So you always okay. really want to do uh, a wine sealed with a cork on its side. That said, if, if you're going to keep it for just a couple weeks, it's not a big deal. But if you're going to keep it for years upon years. And let it age. Exactly. Then you definitely want it Because you've on told us if you store it upright and the cork gets dry, that's when you can get a crumbly cork. Exactly. Because right? it dries out. Mm -hmm. As when the cork is not wet, it's going to shrink. Mm -hmm. And that's, all, that's first of all going to let air in, which is going to age your wine prematurely. But then also it can get very dry and crumbly so that when you try and get out with a corkscrew, then it just breaks. Okay. Screw cap you don't have to store on its side. Definitely not. And I think um, a misunderstanding about screw caps is they just think it's a screw cap. But the technology on screw caps is really uh, interesting in that it's a number of different layers. So you not only have a screw cap, but you also have a liner in there that prevents oxygen from coming in and out. And depending on the quality of the screw cap, you're going to have different uh, levels of technology to control let controlled oxygen in I think the bottom line is that the screw cap does not necessarily indicate anything about the quality right. of the wine or the price necessarily what can people find if they visit mywineschool.com well we have classes that you know people come and, and enjoy wine and food um, but then we also do some online uh, wine classes as well